and we're back that quickly. What sucks is, my whole beginning broadcast didn't save because my phone shut off. So now, when I told everybody that they'll be able to go on and watch it for a few days, now they can't. Uh, Doesn't that suck? Yeah. That pisses me off more than anything. That's a Ustream thing, isn't it? Because they just don't... It should have saved automatically. Yeah. This is what should have happened. But shoulda, coulda, woulda. Ain't my friend. Whatever. Stupid phone. Stupid phone. I'm going to have to plug this back in. So let me unplug it quickly. Plug this back in. No, I'm going to have to stay over here. Oh, I'm Chihuahua. Okay. Can you see me? Can you hear me? Are we back? We're good? Oh, we lost the chat. I probably will have to replay because you went off, so that kind of probably forgot what it was doing. All right, Leslie, I'll see you later. Good night. Good night, Leslie. We'll see you at the next one. Was the sound better with the other one? I'm ah, sorry. Sorry. Was it better because it was louder, softer? What was the reason the sound was better? It was. I can't believe it was better on that tablet. That's interesting. Or is it better on my phone? Happy New Year! Did I even say Happy New Year? I don't remember. Hmm? Oh, the glue was making me mad because it was there and it was stuck, but I just painted it. Oh. Ooh, I forgot I can use these alcohol ink Mmm. dinks. Mmm. Mmm. I wonder what I can do with this M. That's a weird sound. I don't think I'm going to do anything with them now, but... Ooh, I know what I can use. I have vintage glitter. What have I done with it, though? Shoot, what did I do with it? Because I stuck it somewhere to get it out of the way. Hmm, where's my vintage glitter? i got to stand up again and I'm fucking it. Oh, here it is. See? Vintage mica glitter. It's literally vintage. It's literally from the 50s. I have vintage uh, from the 50s. This is from the 50s. Mica glitter. This is real mica flakes to use for glitter. And I think I'm going to use that on my butterflies. In the center and then on the wings and then in the center again or something. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, buddy. I'll use the alien since it dries quickly. Uh, let's see. How do I want to do this? I think I want to do it. You guys can't see what I'm doing. I apologize. I'm sticking a whole bunch of glue onto my butterfly. Now I'm going to do this over the over a piece of scrap paper so I can make some room. 
this over scrap paper and I'm going to dump this crap. I'm gonna have to come on, cooperate, you ass. Jesus. Jesus. Right, dump. And that just had to fall in there. Of course it did. Why not? I'm gonna move that out of the way. Alright. Santa baby. Did everybody get what they wanted for Christmas? No. I wanted a million dollars. What'd you get for Christmas though? Blankets, Yankee candle warmer. Ooh, I love Yankee candles and I love warmers. I have them all over my damn house. I have some cute bottles. My friend brought me one of the girls at Warmer. She bought some cute bottles. Cool. So that's it. Your husband didn't get you anything? No, he never does. Well, I'll take that back. I mean, I just buy my own gifts. Oh, that's right. You told me about that. I forgot. I got a new camera. And a new tripod. <laughs> That's pretty much my Christmas presents. Yeah, Chris didn't get me anything either. I all I got was a uh, gift certificate, uh, and my friend Christy sent me. She sent me um, a whole box of goodies. That was really the only Christmas present I got. And a punch. Bye. Bye. Who all's left in here then? Tina, Jojo, Christy. We're dwindling. Soon it'll be morning and then other people will join. And it'll have a whole new flock of friends. <laughs> Doesn't that look pretty? That might and once the glue dries and you can't see it through the thing because it looks white, but it's not. It's beautiful and pretty and I loves it. Actually, I think I should go all the way around with it, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I think on this one, I'll do it a little different. And I'll do, like, the inside of the butterfly. And then I'll just do, like, like this. You got a curfew? I'm only joking. He goes to bed at 7 in the morning? Mm -hmm. Why? It depends on what time he has to be at work, so. He doesn't have to work till 5 o'clock, so. He stays up all night. Because he works third shift. Uh -huh. I mean, second shift. So he stays up all night. Unless he has to be in the morning. He usually goes to bed anywhere between 2 and. What did I just do? Beat the bottle? And then I did it on the inside of that one. I love Looks the mica glitter. Looks very pretty. I love the mica glitter. It's my favorite. They used to use this in vintage, like back when they would do Christmas ornaments. They would use this type of glitter. This type of glitter shit. And then I'll do this one. worst feeling. It's that burning feeling. So much fun to burn yourself. <laughs> I 
It was so much fun to burn myself and required to wear a bandage for the for like three weeks. shit all over the place. I dumped a bunch of it on my floor. My floor is going to glitter for a while. Alright. It's a glittery. It's a big old glittery mess. But that looks pretty. Pretty. Pretty, pretty. Yeah. Okay, that was a mess. I'll well dump the rest of it on the floor. I just gotta get it out of here because it's just gonna get, get messier. When I was a kid, we would find mica rocks outside and sit there and peel them because you could peel the layers off. That was so much fun. Now, if you try to buy a mica rock, it's so much expensive. Yeah. Yeah, I wanted to buy a sheet because you could do like crafts with it. Yeah. And it, make a mica book. A mica book? Ooh, you can make a journal out of mica. Like use it as a cover. Oh, if it's thick, yeah. 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 Oh. It's expensive. Yeah, that's, that's expensive. <laughs> well, they had the sheets that were thinner mm. and you can like use it to, like, you know how some people take acetate and stamp on it? Well, you can mm -hmm. use the mica sheets and do that. And it was pretty cool looking. But you can even take those sheets, those thin ones, and you can use those as your pages. You can make a journal and you can use them as your pages. I would thought they would break. They're well, not very sturdy. You have to put your... Well, it depends on how thin they are. If you get the kind that's... Um, they have the mica where they took, like, a whole bunch of different mica and then put it like, together yeah. and they would make lampshades with it and stuff. That's a lot sturdier. You could probably do that with that without an issue. But that would be cool. You should find somewhere with Yeah, some. I've seen a mica book before like that, so they probably had layers of mica together. Because that's what her pages were, the mica. Because they adhere it somehow together, yeah. so that, and then it's sturdy. Because regular mica sheets are really, really fucking fragile. Yeah, well, it's, and it's so fragile. And then you have to put paper between them. Yeah. So that they don't, when they clink together. True. Clink, clink. Look how pretty it looks. I love it. Hmm. Now I want to put something there, like a rose, like a little rose or something. I want to put some flowers on it, definitely. That'll probably be the next thing I do. It's flowers. Well, I don't know what mine's doing, but Chrissy's like, I'm pretty. here, kinda. We asked to. We're here, kinda. <laughs> That's been on all night thing. Mm-hmm. I don't sleep anyway, so whatevs. I'm always up till this late. Now I haven't heard from Chris yet. I usually go to work soonish. But I'm off today. Just like everybody else. Well, you don't work on Saturday. Uh, well, that's right. It's not Saturday. Yeah. Duh. It's Friday. Yeah. Yeah, I work on some weekends. Hmm. Yes, thankfully. Yeah, thankfully. Some bandages falling off. These bandages suck. Almost all bandages suck. Yeah, so no, these are really bad. These are those. They're not bandage brand. They're that other brand. Hmm. Cheap brand. Off brand. I don't remember the name. Yeah, it doesn't matter, really. Lend an ear and a chocolate. I'm not going to lend you a chocolate. I mean, they're going to give it to you. Or not. <laughs> Are I going to add a ribbon to the top of my bottle? Actually, I'm probably going to add seam binding and make it and crinkle it. And put a bow and have it crinkle. Crinkle, crinkle. Yeah, that's what I think I'm going to do. I think I'm going to do the crinkly kind of seam binding on the top. All right, Tina. See you later. Night, Bye. Tina. Thanks for stopping.
spending the night with us. Hell yeah. Good Happy morning. New Year. Now there's only two. There's only gonna be two of us in here. What? Huh? Introduce your chocolate noir to film noir. Your chocolate noir to be moving. Whatever. They're getting desperate now. Okay, so there's what I got. I think I might be done for the moment. Maybe, no, but I need some over here. You need what? Shells? Little shells over here. She shells. She shells from the seashore. Mmm, these chocolates are yummy. I love Dove chocolate, it's the best. Or loquacious starting with learning the word loquacious I don't know what the fuck that means look at how cool it's coming out she's starting with the shells up at the top and all she's putting more shells and more shells and what's cool is you can put something coming out of this one. Yeah, I think I'm done on that side. Well, what the hell? Water. <laughs> one, from when I cleaned it out. And then I'll, I'll, do, I'll do something on that side. Maybe I can find something. <clears throat> something yeah. In my hand. <laughs> and then if I leave that, then I can put something in the main. Whatever they are there. <sighs> Do you have any hooks, like fishing hooks? I'm sure I can get some from somebody. Because you can always take a, a standing block and make it not pointy enough yeah. to hurt you and then glue it on with some something. Well, and I might do some, uh, I have those little sticks too, like, uh, I have pins. I have some pins in them, you know, stick pins. Oh, yeah. And beads on it. And then I've got some other things that you can stick in and stick a picture on it. Mm -hmm. I actually have um, an octopus mm. little mold for mm. clay. I might do that. I might do some air dry clay. Yeah, that would be cool. The little octopus. Yep. Yeah. Octopussy. That would be cute. We could put him maybe coming out of the show. Yeah. Well, that would be really cute. He's boop, about, boop. He's about that size. You know what I need? I need, I need more of these doilies. Does anybody know where I can get these tiny little doilies? I hate that I can't. And when I do find them, they're so expensive. It's ridiculous. Anybody know where I can get them cheap? Cheap like? Never can find doilies. Maybe mm -hmm. eBay. I don't know. Everything's on eBay. Yeah. It's true. Believe. Put that word on the side. I don't know. I don't know. Excuse me. Sorry, not sorry. Um, let's see. What kind of crap do I got going on in here? I got all kinds of crap going on in here. Um, um, 
Oh, that had to fall down, didn't it? Ugh. I need something. So I'm going to put a thing at the top. I want to put some lace going around here. I need some sort of flower. I need to look for a flower. Actually, if I can get to this one box, I know that I can find my dreams. Okay. I hate this fucking house, I'm telling you. I need to move. This shit ain't gonna fly. I can't stand that everything in this house comes... Literally everything on my shelf comes down as an avalanche. Sucks. Sucks. Can't wait to move and have some room so that I am not avalanching everything all the time. I have horrible storage in here. There's just no room for my crap. Said it would be pretty. Huh? Not really sure. Pretty. I think the ribbon and the Oh, the ribbon and the lace and the flowers and the this is my box my special box. I barely use the stuff out of here. Yeah, I have a special box. But, but I'm like, I don't know why I keep putting it in there. There we go, that's what I'm looking for. I'm gonna gesso one of these flowers and stick it there and then put one or two there. I just don't use a lot of this stuff. Because I don't like to. So it was mostly all of this was given to me. <gasps> I forgot I had these stick pins. But they were so pretty I never wanted to take them out. Those are bullets. One would look pretty on your bottle. Mm. Gold. I don't know. Maybe. Yeah, how do I get it back in there the way that, the way it was? Son of a bitch. Good enough. Too white. That's racist. No, yeah, that's really the only thing I would need. To use out of here. Maybe some of these. Where can I? There we go. Maybe that. Okay, good night, Jojo. Good, good morning. morning. Whatever. Good night, good morning. Thanks for spending the night with us. <laughs> morning. We had a sleepover. Woohoo! A crafty sleepover. So now who's left? Just, just Christy. Christy. Just it's just us. Woohoo! I need to just so that. I don't think I'm gonna use that one. But I might use some of those Damon. I forgot these were in there. I love these. So pretty. I don't know. Very chubby cheek. Now what's happening? Nothing. It's about my bedtime. It's really past my bedtime. It's past your bedtime. I'm going to put pink flowers. I think I'm going to use three Seriously. pink flowers. So I'll save one down there and I will gesso the shit out of these. Gesso the shit. I don't 
think anybody else did a bottle but you and me, I believe. Christy. Yeah, just me and Christy. And, well, you. Just us. We're the special the ones. Oh, kid. crap. Look what I did. This better come out. That's one of my favorite brushes. I'm going to be really uh, pissed off if that didn't. I hate that. I don't do that very often. Where'd you leave it? Sitting there. Oh. Better not have ruined it. I'm going to be really mad. If it gets dry, I'll take it back with me and I can try it. I have that soap stuff that softens it. Well, somebody said, um, what was it? Nail polish, uh, acetate will we'll fix mm -hmm. it. So, and I have that, so I'll try that. It was one of those per painters guys that do like mm -hmm. painter paint painting on YouTube. Yeah. He was like talking about how to care for your brushes and stuff. And he said that if you ever get paint on your brushes and it gets dry, you just use just put the tip of it and don't put the whole thing in because yeah. it'll eat the glue away. Just put enough where it's getting on the bristles. Whatever they're called, the hairs. The bristles, hairs. The thing I'm a jigger is the paint with fingers. The fingers. The things that pick up the paint. No. The problem is, is the color is completely off on this flowers. And I think I need to go with this color mm. and then gesso it if I have to after. Because it's just completely wrong. It's too bright pink where this is all a very rose muted dusty pink. Dusty pink. So we're gonna have to repaint. Our bot left us. Who? The Ustream bot. What does it's that mean? It's an automatic bot. It's just the Ustream thing that helps you. It doesn't nope. really help you, but it's just part of Ustream. Well, how, what what made it leave? Because there's no, there's just two people left. No. Oh. It's like a mod bot, but. A mod bot? I think it does like a chat, right? It'll kick if people chat too fast and stuff huh. like that. So now we can do what we want. Now I bet we could swear in the chat room. Possibly. Because our babysitter's gone. <laughs> oh, my flipping back. My pussy and my crack. Sorry. Stupid song. <laughs> Chris is probably like, what the hell did you just say? There's a song. It's a stupid song. It's ridiculous. And it's dumb and I don't like it. But every time I say my back hurts and or somebody says, oh, my back, I always want to say, my neck, my back. <laughs> Ustream bot leaving. We need five assistants with Ustream. Please ask your questions at blah blah blah. She's finally laughing at you. Who? Christine. She's laughing at me. Mm -hmm. Really, she's laughing at your twat. Yeah. That's what you're talking about. And sixteen. And I'm already fucking tired. <laughs> <laughs> it's only the first day and I'm already over it. Yeah, I'm over it good. because every year I find out I have a new disease and that's been going on since two thousand and five. Oh, we should take bets on what this year's gonna be. Yeah, I don't wanna. Uh, the last year was cancer. This year it's gonna be nothing. I hope nothing as well. I'm gonna have like rickets. Rickets. Mm, rickets. I don't even know what rickets are. 
of scabies. That's what that's what I would get this year. Seriously, me and Chris found it amusing that every year I had a new illness. And last year it came early in the year. Like really early. Chris says she's, she knows what you sang. That's her favorite song. Uh, it is? <laughs> she didn't really say that. <laughs> she just said she knows the song. That song was actually in the movie The Proposal with Sandra Bullock and... Yeah, it was. I remember that. Ryan Reynolds, because she sang it with the grill. Didn't she sing the other song? Something about the balls or something? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, was it that song instead of the... Yeah, I think it was. I don't think it was the pussy and crack. It was something about balls. Yeah, you're right. Or wasn't she going like, Ooh, skeet, skeet, motherfucker. Yeah, I remember her doing that. <laughs> She's funny in that movie. That was a good one, no? That was a good movie. I like Brian Reynolds. I do too. He's gorgeous. Ryan Reynolds and the other guy. Um, Bradley Cooper? Yes. Bradley Cooper. My favorite, though, is Robert Downey Jr. I'll take him and break him. He's aged well. Mm hmm. I like his album. Yeah, I love Iron Man. Yeah, it's a great character. Did you ever hear his album that he had? Oh, God, he could sing. But I remember having, he was like, you know, was all that, not all, I mean, I'm a huge 80s fan, so he's in all those good 80 movies. Yeah. Good, bad, then he had that crazy break, but he came back, and like I said, he's aged well and done very well. He's come back a couple of times. That's the thing, but he's an amazing actor, so. He's kind of scary because if you really think about actors they're really really good liars yeah pretty much that is it <laughs> that's why you always really see like a lot of them they always have so many relationships and breakups because of the fact that they're such good liars next year i wanted to sleep over with you Come if you would if you would have just left the over out i would have thought you were creepy <laughs> Next year, I just want to sleep with you. <laughs> that would have been hilarious. Wait, next year or this year? 2016 or 2017? Let's make it happen this year. She means like next New Year's Eve. Well, you should come. Come. Um. Yeah. Stupid thing. You should come but. to TNSA. Oh my God, that's stupid. Yeah. Yeah. Like do a little, like they have those little bed and breakfasts you can rent. You'd probably get kicked out. Social stream? What's all these people? That's what I'm saying. Those are the people that should have been in chat. Um, Hopefully we got them all over because at some point I started doing them. Yeah, it definitely would have been easier here. <laughs> we wouldn't all fit in this fucking room. No. Well, next, but next year I'll have plenty of room. It could all fit in my basement, but it smells funny down there, and it wouldn't be really fun. And there's no heat. It can all fit in my basement. However, I don't have my craft shit there, and I ain't bringing it down there. Yeah. Yeah. If I was staying in this house, I would have it in my bedroom. Does your bedroom go out to the back part where the deck is back there? Mm-hmm. Okay. My neck, my back, my pussy, and my crack. My neck, my back, my pussy, and my crack. Oh, like very, very nice. <laughs> I like that version. <laughs> No, I just was saying it. I have no idea. Yeah, it sounded Indian. Like the 
Well, I was trying. I don't. Why is there an actual Bollywood version? No. That's oh. What I'm saying. You just made the Bollywood oh. version. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> very good. I very don't good. Think there's a actual, but I you don't, never know. Cause I'm not sure thing. why why she has a crack and a pussy and why I want it, but I don't know. There was this, um, these radio DJs called Scott and Todd, and you could still look this up online. They're, they were hilarious, and they had a, um, they would do, um, it was Scott and Todd in the morning, I believe, and they would do, um, prank calls, and they were the best prank calls ever. They were very, like, awesome, and... The one guy, he called up, because there's a lot of tolls in New Jersey, and so the people work in the toll booth. And this one guy, and they have, like, these baskets that you throw the money into. Um, so this one guy, or the, what, the guy, one of the Scott and Todd guys, they called up the toll booth place, like the main building for that or whatever it was, um, their customer service or whatever, and he says, I am very angry. I lost my dot in your toll booth and I and I need it back. And, he, and they were like, they were like, you lost your what? My dot. And he kept going, your what? My dot. And he was like, I lost my dot. What are you not understanding? I lost my dot. And so, and so finally the lady on the phone was like laughing hysterically because she couldn't understand them. And he was like, this is very insulting that you're laughing and at my time of crisis. And I, you know, it was just fucking hilarious, like crazy hilarious, like the things he was saying. And so finally she understand that it was the dot off his head fell into the basket. And she, and he was saying, I need to find your lost and found. Blah, blah, blah. It was so funny. It was the funniest thing ever. And it was funny, really funny. And there was another one where this and what's funny is a lot of them he'll have somebody that'll put him up to it like somebody will call in and say i want you to prank my mother here's what you should yeah. say and this that and the other here's all my information so this one guy called in and he or well he was a young guy like probably like 20 and he wanted to prank his mom so he had them call and pretend that he, that he was a police officer and that he picked up their her son naked on the beach and he took him to Rikers Island, and his uh, his name was Officer Ripping Clip, and she was buying all this, and it was so funny. And then her friend was there in the background. You hear her friend going, "What? I don't understand. What?" Because she was like repeating everything to the friend. It was so funny. Me and Chris laughed over this, and we would listen to it over and over. It was the funniest thing. And then he goes, he goes to her, he goes to her. You tell your friend to clip it. And she goes, um, or, or to zip it or something or to be quiet or whatever. That's right. She goes, you, he goes, you tell your friend to, to zip it over there and you know, whatever. And she turns to her friend and goes, officer rip and clip said to clip it <laughs> or something. It was so funny. And she goes, huh. he, the lady in the background says to her, you're in a mood today. Or some sh it was just so funny. And I used to have all of these on tape or on CD or on something. But you could still look them all up. They're hilarious. Fucking hilarious. They were the best, best pranks I've ever heard were theirs. They always did them in such detail. That's always better. Like, I don't like the ones. They do so many pranks now and they're like. Oh, yeah, stupid. Well, the shit you shouldn't joke about. Mm hmm Shit you shouldn't joke about. Like, shit that somebody's gonna shoot you over. Well, the last like one I... cheating s stuff, or... Yeah. Like somebody died, or right. somebody had a heart like that. Yeah, just, that's not right. I don't think it's that shit. I don't think that stuff when it's funny. On YouTube, um, you know Jen, who Jenna Marbles is on YouTube? I think so, yeah. She and her boyfriend did a pranking video where they called up businesses that they didn't work at and said that they weren't going to be able to make it to work. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> it was so funny. And it, it 
all, most of them caught on and realized, well, wait a minute, you don't work here. But the last one, it was like a big, bigger company. I can't remember the name of it. And it was so funny. I think it was Home Depot or something where they have a lot of employees. So you couldn't really, you wouldn't know the name of somebody. And they, she was like, my name is Jessica and I'm not going to be able to make it into work today. And, and the guy was like, uh, you know, and she would say it was because, you know, she would say like, I'm not gonna be able to make it into work because like I want I don't want to come into work because I I I'm I want the option to stay home and I'm not really sure if I'm gonna stay home so that's why I can't come into work and it was like really stupid re that's not a reason you that you shouldn't come into work the guy said. and she's like well I'm just not gonna come in and and he was like well you're you know you you know it was just really funny I don't know stupid but funny yeah, so funny. Know. I'll have to find the, the, the... The sad thing is, we get people to call out for stupid ass. We had a dude call out. This is actually probably the most phenomenal one. And this is real. He called out because he bit his cheek. What? Fucking dude, yes. One of our male providers. I was like, dude, you're a fucking dude. You fucking bit your cheek. Yes, he would not come to work because he bit his cheek and it hurt so bad. <laughs> I was like, fucking pussy. Are you kidding me? And then one, actually, one of my girls just got, well, she quit before she got fired, but she tried to call out last week for Christmas Eve and Christmas Day, and she called, <laughs> but this is what was so stupid about it. She could have gotten away with it if she was smarter, because she called the day before. She's like, I just got surprised with a trip to Florida for tomorrow, and so I can't work tomorrow. <laughs> I was like, yeah, you can't do that. Yeah. I was like, I'm sorry. You can't do that. You have to go to work tomorrow. Was so, she one of the nurse practitioners? She's actually a PCT. What is um, a PCT? A glorified medical assistant. Oh. Or not, but it's just the, the one who checks in the patients and everything. They're basically just a medical assistant. And then, um, but she, but, and then, but then I looked at her record and she had called out Sunday. So I was like, that bitch is already in Florida. Huh. Um, cause she had called out Sunday and she didn't give a reason. So I was like, yeah, she's already in Florida. I was like, she's not going to be there tomorrow, you guys, even though she swore up and down. Like, so she talked to her direct manager, which is, um, bad. She got she fired, but like, of course she won't get fired because nobody ever fires anybody. Oh, no, we fire people. But she, she was going to get fired, but she didn't go in the next day. And so, she, so then the next day she called out because of her lupus was acting up. I was like, so your lupus act up? Well, how, how, how is the sand helping your lupus? Is that helping? Why don't you try to stick so, some sand down your fucking bathing suit, like, lady? Um, and then she called out for Christmas Day, too. So, or not Christmas. We were all, so it was the day before. It was the day before Christmas Eve and then Christmas Eve. So it was Christmas. But I was like, yeah, the bitch is already on board. Yeah. And then she quit. So then the next day she called and quit <laughs> with no notice. And I'm like, yeah, fucking genius. I really hope you had a really good Lose your job up. over a freaking trip to Florida? Probably a good job, too. The thing is a good job. It's a good paying job. It makes no sense to me. She hasn't even had over 90 days. Huh. That's why. Well, they actually start, they start out at $12, which is really good. That's a good job. Yeah. And they don't really... I mean, it's better to be in a CNA. Than the Did you say she only worked there 90 days, right? She wasn't even packed through. Her yeah, that's days. that's why because she probably goes from job to job to job and fucks it up. What about the the practitioners? Do they do a lot of shit like that? Not as bad, but they still do the job. Because I would think. Like you think like I'm thinking. You make fifty fucking dollars an hour. Right. You fucking went to school. You got a fucking degree. You are fucking stupid. <laughs> mm-hmm. It cracks me up. They're so unintelligent sometimes. But even people who make D's and C's, they get, they pass, and they get right. a certificate. A diploma. That's the thing with Lisa. But that she... guy who called out with the cheek, that was a dude. He was a private, he was a nurse practitioner. Huh. He was a PA. Just a fucking dude. Really, dude? I get annoyed with people who call it for migraines, <laughs> but that's just because I never call out when I have one. I have, I have not gone. There's been times I never thought a migraine. I had migraines and they were always bad, but see, like, like one of the people in the hospital, like a doctor, told me, 
It's not a migraine unless you're in bed and you have your eye closed. Otherwise, it's a bad headache. Exactly. He's like, you'll know it's a migraine when you're feeling nauseous and you're under the covers and your eyes are closed. And I'm like, oh, okay, whatever. And then... I mean, it, it is true, but you... I mean, I still go to work with him. Yeah. But I... And then I had a migraine. Like, a real bad migraine where I was under the covers, eyes were shut. I could not even open my eyes and see daylight. It was not possible. As yeah. soon as I did, it was like instantly... No, like my head was going... Pajum, 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 and then I would throw up. And I was like, yeah, holy no. shit. This, it was crazy. And the first time that ever happened, I was just like... I thought I was... I thought I was dying. I only get like two of those a year, but oh, I hate my it. headaches are still just, I mean, they're still just, as, I can't, I'm the meanest person ever. I shouldn't go to work, <laughs> honestly, because I, I'm mean as hell, but I have to fill this oh, I couldn't do it. Well, my job, I'm doing a lot of walking around and moving and, uh, you know, it's like when you bend over is when your head pounds the most and yeah. there's no way I could clean a house oh, like that. I had one when I was at, um. Well, they got really bad. They were okay for a while, but then the older I got, then I started getting the vertigo, and I would get more nauseous. So the older I get, the more nauseous I get, the more vertigo I get. Oh. And so they are worse because I can't, I can't handle them as well. But I had one, and I had one of the VA, and I was oh, on a one-on-one -on -one patient, so you can't leave the room. You can't go anywhere. And my vertigo was so bad, and then I was so sick, but I couldn't sit down longer than a minute, and I couldn't stand up longer than a minute. So for 12 hours, I was sitting down, up, uh, standing up, sitting down, standing up, sitting down. I was God. so annoyed. I was like, I've got to get the fuck out of here. And I think the only other day, I've gotten better about it because I won't go to work if it's really bad. Because um, I drove home with one and I didn't think I was going to make it home. Because I couldn't even see that well. Because I was so, my vision was blurry, it was bad. And that did teach me that if it gets bad, that... Yeah. Mm-mm. <laughs> or I'll leave her if they get really bad. Now what are we doing? And pink glitter. Oh no, it's not open. <gasps> oh my god. Chrissy had one so bad that they gave her emergency CT. Emergency CT. And what did they find on the CT? <sighs> hopefully her brain. Yes, hopefully. <laughs> oh, yeah, I've heard about the pressurized room thing. Somebody else I know had that. I've been doing really well, actually, the last couple of months. I've been doing, um... running my peppermint, running my aromatherapy thing, like my peppermint thing, like, all the time. What does that do? So the peppermint is good because it opens up your sinuses and it opens up all that and it helps relieve. <laughs> so, you know, I put it, the little essential oil. Yeah. In my little thing. I feel like it runs from my little thing. Hmm. This makes my house smell like peppermint. It's cool. really bad. a little bit. But that's the same. If you don't have a migraine, if you have a headache, you still can't function with a headache all the fucking time. No. I mean, that's the problem. You're going to have, you either have a headache and then it turns into a migraine, which just means it's really, it's a migraine because it never goes away. I'm definitely not a fan of migraines. I never had a headache like my entire life until I would just get migraines pretty much or super bad headaches as the doctor would say they were. Okay. I just put my shoes on my fat little sausage feet. <laughs> Hit the road. Hit the road. 
Jack and don't you come back. So it's funny because like she says not a damn thing. It was amazing. But what? she was saying not a damn thing on the CT scan and she was saying the pressurized room was amazing, I think. <laughs> but it's just the way she's because she said it back to them. <clears throat> And then find a damn thing. It was amazing. That looks pretty. Let's go on. Pretty. Give me a little more of this shit. Check out her Facebook. She did some updates. Updates! Thought I was almost Glazing. Mm, glazing. What kind of glazing? Shit. I'm not sure. Oh, cool. Look shinier, brighter, brighter. Shiny. What else are you going to be adding to it, Miss Thing? didn't pick up as much of the rock glitter as it did the, did the other kind. Can't get a hold of it. Problem. That's better. There we go. That's what we need to know. We need to dip it. Dip it. Dip it. I need to dip it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I love this Aileen's thick glue shit. That's amazing. I love Aileen's glues, apparently. I didn't think I would like them. I didn't think I cared enough to like I them. I didn't even know I got her super tacky glue. Or one of her tacky glues, and it's really good. Yeah. She doesn't know what she's going to do with her bottle. She's going to shove it up somebody's ass. Actually, I think I'll leave that one plain. And I'll dump that glitter out. No more glitter! Shit. Glue everywhere, though. I got one chipboard flower and a button. We need more flowers! 
crap, 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 crap. This is a white sparkly pen. Yeah. supposed to work. I don't like it. I don't like it. Alright, so much for that. Oh, shit. I need glitter. Here we go. We have this glitter. That's not the right glitter either. Where the hell is my glitter? Glue. There it is. Oh, crap. No, crap. Come back here. I can't reach it. Oh, I hate this room. It's so inconvenient. Have you ever done an altered bot bottle before, Christy? Before this one? Cherry. You're popping your altered bottle cherry. Let's see, we'll stick this one up. And we'll suck this one in. And these will go here. Get it down there. I don't need something there now. Maybe it needs one of these guys. to cut through. Forget about it. Okay. Prettiness. Prettiness. Pretty. What do you 
think? Beautiful. I love it. I love all my What do you think, Christy? I gotta put the ribbon up here with the seam binding. But other than that, it's pretty much done. Done, bitches. You gonna put it right at the top of the lip? Up here? Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Best. That'll look the best is. Okay, and then I bought this. I mean, I brought this if you wanted it. This was the thing I bought that I don't use. Yeah. That I was telling you about. It's a faux door. It's a Midori thing. I it's a big sparrow, but it's not big enough. Or I just, it's in the middle size. I don't like it. Because I've only got one elastic. But you know how to put it in and then use it with another elastic. Cool. Sweet. I like it. I'll make some books for it. She gave me a present. It's a Midori thing, I'm a jiggity. It's called Chic Sparrow. Yes, she's Made great. in the US of A. Really Stick nice it up stuff. there. Fancy and shit. Fancy and shit. Oh, there it is. <coughs> Thank you. It's coming almost dry. keep saying it over and over again like it's gonna get any better. Not gonna happen. I need to find some seam binding, but I don't know what they did with it. What is in here? Here it is. I need to find that's what I'm looking for. That's the right color kind of. Oh, shit, maybe not. Let's see. Well, I can use this one because that's always the right. That matches. Let's see if this one goes better. Take it and wet it and scrunch it and dry it, yeah. Ah, oh, scrunch it time! My bottle or your bottle? Because mine has a spriggy thingy. It's got this. 
It's got a spray. What other kind of spriggy thingy? I don't have anything else. That's it. This one ain't crinkling as good. I have some like that. They don't really crinkle. So what I have to do is I have to leave them balled up and then hand dry. Like dry or that way. Oh, I ain't got no time for that. <laughs> oh, she said her bottle. Oh. I wish they would make some, um, and they might, you know, some sprays that are, instead of just like the typical, like made out of actual wood little sticks, like little thin wood stick things that are pretty with glitter or something on them. This crinkled up really good. The other one, not so, not as good. Who's cigarette? No. no. You be quiet. This one's still wet a little bit. That one's still wet. Ah, oh, they're both a little wet. Falling off. That's nice. fabulous. I'm so glad we altered a bottle. Mercury. Great idea. Even though mine isn't finished, I'll try to finish it by 2017. By 2017? Yeah, I'll try to finish it before we go into the next new year. Oh, that's a good idea. And that, that's an intention. Not legally set in stone. I hate bows. I never can make them right. They don't come out right. It's shabby chic. It's not supposed to be perfect. No, but I at least want the bow to sit so you can see that it's a flipping bow. <laughs> I don't want it to be perfect. I just want it to look like a damn bow. I'll just take some hot glue and bit glue that bitch down. That's what I do. That's what I do. You know, bitch. Tell me what to do. You ain't my daddy. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. That's what it needed. There's the butter bow. It's your butterfly. See my bow? Oh, I gotta, I gotta re-glue my butterfly. My butterfly is like flutter by. It's because I tried to go through the lace. Just fine, but not enough glue. Not enough glue. And all this screwing around. Yay! Bottle done, bitches. I loves it. It's beautiful. It's beautiful.
don't know if you could see it. I don't know if I'm holding it right and if you could see the beautimousness of it. I need to take pictures of it and put it up on the online. Oh. back brace, but oh, I'm more uncomfortable, I'd rather my back hurt. <sighs> Thank you, Christy. She says, I'm going to have to finish mine later. I'm about out of out of go-go. <laughs> yeah. Mine's all, not finished either. We're all out of go-go. Yeah. Got to find some go-go because I got to go-go home. Wake me up before you go-go. Well, like I said, at least it's nice because I can be like, oh my God, it's 5 a.m. But then it's 5-5 five, five and I'm home. Like it's 5.05 and I'm home. Mm-hmm. So. Mm -hmm. I love this mess that I've made over here. Yeah. It's a little scary. I'll spend the next two days cleaning up after it. That's nice. I always make such a damn mess when I do things. Like, so do I. It's just I think everybody it's clusterfuck. Does. Well, not everybody does, but if they don't, they're not that creative. Huh. That's what I have to say about it. Well, you know there's people out there that craft, and they like... Put everything back in its place as soon as they're done with it, and you know, and I'm an, I'm a bit of a neat freak, but not that freaking bad. Holy crap! Yeah, like those people who do their little. This is my tour of my room, and everything is like. Oh, everything is so perfect. Like, Bitch, what you making? Cause you ain't making nothing. You just buy and stuff and put it in your room. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sure they are, but I'm just like. Uh... I did find the twigs. Yay. Off that lighted tree thingy that my neighbor gave me, white and glittery. Oh, cool. Oh, there you go. Repurposing and recycling. Mm-hmm. Good job. Just let me know when you want, and I'll, I'll uh... I don't remember what I was going to say now. I lost my train of thought. Huh? I don't want anything. Huh? I don't want anything. <laughs> <I'm good. laughs> Just got to pack my shit up. Got to pack my shit up. I forget what I was going to say because I had something to say and now I can't remember. I'm thinking if we don't make this a weekly thing, we make it an every other week thing. I mean, if we make it a weekly thing, I'm obviously not going to do it all night long, but, you know, every time, that's not going to happen. This is because it was New Year's Eve. Maybe we'll do, like, three hours or two and a half yeah, hours or something. We can do all night again. Well, not. Yeah. Next time we'll be more prepared. Yeah. I don't think we did too bad. No, we did really well. And we didn't really People are going to be pissed off if they can't watch the Ustream, though. Have any... 
Because I had a lot of people say, well, will I be able to watch it? I said, well, Ustream keeps it up on their thing, but now that the camera crashed, well, I'm going to say, oh well. Here's you was a special one. I couldn't save it because it crashed. So they'll be able to watch the other one I saved before I switched back to my phone, and then this one I'll save. So they can watch that. They can watch that. You missed all the fun. <sighs> Visual effects. Charger in her. You want me to undo it? No, oh, for Christy. She doesn't see what you have, please. She doesn't have the energy. Uh -uh. Which, I mean, I don't do it either. That's really a. Uh... And then I'll probably come back and do some more in the next day. Oh, no. Well, I did need that one, but I need this one too. Oh. I don't know, that's the one that you plugged in that was... I plugged in? Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, I didn't get over there. Oh, that's the computer. <laughs> yeah, that was my laptop that we that didn't work. What the hell? No, no. What is going on? I don't know, I'm sorry. I don't know. Okay, well, I don't know what I did. I got like a tangled mess over here like you would not believe right now. And, you know... That's how it goes. That's how it goes, bitches. Bitches and hoes, that's how it goes. Oh, I forgot to put the lace up here. Actually, I want to put... Um, I want to put my rhinestones up here. I want to put that up here. Which I'm gonna cut a purse, a piece, a purse off of that. Silly. He's silly. Bigger. What's he doing? He's like, what you do? Just watching me. Oh. I don't know what I'm doing. He's a mess. He's a hot mess puppy. He's a good puppy. Whereas Piglet's a pain in the ass. I love him, but he's a pain in the ass. Ow, it burned my selfie. Oh. Oh. Uh, Christy wanted to see my bottle. Her bottle is beautiful. It's got seashells. She's going to finish it at home. She didn't finish it here. I didn't. I'll make sure that she puts a picture up. I will finish up. it, and I will put a picture up. I will make her. So that's cool. We had, like, 30 people, I yeah, think. Yeah, we did really well. We had lots of and out. considering it was New Year's flipping Eve, I can only imagine that we'll have a lot more people on a regular day. Ooh, let me add more bling. Hails to the yeah yeah. <laughs> well, because I really didn't add any bling to it. At all. You're that's what I was thinking. I was like, hmm, ow, ow, burning, burning. Why do I always burn myself? I don't know, I did it earlier. It was your turn, I guess. I know I did good tonight. I didn't really burn myself much. Oh, yeah, that's what it needed. Hell yeah. It needed that. If you like it, then you gotta put a ring on it. <laughs> I put a ring on it. Ring you on see? It. I put a blingy ring. Blingy ringy ding 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 dong ding. Alright, I think we're gonna end this shit because I'm tired and I gotta clean this crap up. Christy, it was fun. I'm glad you stuck it out with us. We had a blast.
And I know you're tired as hell. I can take you off this now. Mm -hmm. I can show you out here. Wait, I'll walk you out here and show you where Tigger is laying. Oh, crap. I hope I didn't just screw this up. There it is. Um, I can show you out here where Tigger is laying. Oh, and there's my tree. I still have my tree up and lit. It's pretty. I'll keep it's it pretty. forever. And there's Tigger. If you could see him, it's dark in here. It's okay, There's Tigger. What's Tigger doing? He's so cute. What's that? And then this is my dirty kitchen. And my dirty dining room table, which has crap all over it. And then we can go back towards the craft room. And all the way in the back of the hallway, that's my bedroom. That's the guest room, and that's the bathroom. And then we're back here. And it says, Pink Poodle Headquarters. Craft at your own risk. Stupid. Yes. Seriously. <sighs> look, you, look. Already breaking stuff. And it's my breaking boobs. Mess. <laughs> All right, Christy, we'll see you later. Good night, Christy. Bye. Sleep well.